Oh my god. Okay, let's get started. You don't want zero problems, big fella. Hey everyone, it's Ella, and today I'm coming to you from my floor because the countdown has officially begun. I moved to New York City one week from tomorrow, and I will be living in a dorm at Parsons School of Design at the new school in Greenwich Village. And I'm so excited. I have done literally so much preparation, so much shopping, so much like talking with my roommate and my sweet mates about what to buy. And today I'm gonna to be showing you some of the things that I've purchased in preparation to move to New York City. Um, all of this stuff will be going into my apartment style dorm at the new school, which is why I don't know if this video will be titled apartment hall or dorm hall. It's basically the same because I'm living in an apartment that is part of a dorm. Yeah, let's just get started. The first place that I went was the Apple Store because I was using a MacBook Air from 2011, I think. I put it in my like 14th birthday video and I hadn't upgraded my computer since then and literally the speakers didn't work, the USB ports didn't work, I couldn't edit videos on it. All of that on top of the fact that the new school doesn't allow MacBook Airs for Parsons students. They said you have to have a MacBook Pro with a certain amount of storage, yada yada yada. So the first thing that I picked up was a new computer and this is by far the biggest purchase that was made for my dorm hall. Um, this is the Space Gray MacBook Pro 13 inch with 512 gigabytes of storage and it has the touch screen on it. Um, this was actually a graduation gift from my parents because, yeah, I just desperately needed a new computer and then on top of that, the school said I needed a new computer, so yes, thank you to my parents for that because it's literally 1,000 times better than my old one, which was like literally not functioning anymore. I also got a new phone because I was using my iPhone 6S and it was shattered and it was out of storage and the battery wasn't working. And I just like, I had an upgrade anyways with the whole like every year plan or whatever. So I got a new phone and this is the iPhone 7 in matte black. I did a Twitter poll and you guys said that I should get the matte black one. So I did. And this case is from TJ Maxx. But yeah, I needed that. Plus it has 128 gigabytes of storage. So I can vlog my entire move-in process for you guys. Which literally everyone has asked me for moving vlogs and I will be doing them. On to like decor and apartment supplies. My number one place to go is TJ Maxx Home Goods and Marshalls. They have the best supplies for like home decor. I always shop there with my mom when she needs to redecorate. And finally it's my turn to pick out stuff for myself, so that's so exciting. Um, the first thing that I got from Home Goods was this waste basket. And I got this because me and my roommate are kind of going for like cozy chill like neutral vibes and this reminded me of something that Jean DeMoss would have and she's my icon so I got this to just put my like waist in yeah so we have a kitchen in our suite so I had to get like kitchen supplies <laughs> and they're really heavy the plates that I got are made in Portugal and they're microwave safe and they look like this. Um, I'm obsessed. I literally spent so long looking for plates that I actually liked. And these were at Home Goods. They were $5 a plate and then I think $4 a bowl. And we're all getting our own individual like plateware. So I got two plates and two bowls just in case I had company or I didn't feel like washing one. I would have a second one. I really like these. They remind me of something you can buy at Anthropology for a lot more expensive. And I honestly wish that I was getting like an entire like set because I want to use this like plateware forever because it's so freaking cute. I literally started crying when I found those plates because I had been looking for so long and couldn't find any that I liked. Alright, in this bag next to me, this is from TJ Maxx. I got a decorative pillow that says Boston. Um, in my Oxbow dorm, I had a pillow that said London and I just saw this pillow. It was... $19.99 which was so expensive for a pillow I was like are you freaking kidding me but I thought it was cute so I got it and again it just goes with the whole like neutral vibes very cozy looking and it reminded me of home I literally forgot to show my favorite thing from this haul but it's like this this back pillow with armrests my mom calls this a husband because like it holds you but like not everyone wants a husband 
so I'm just gonna call it a little sheep because mine is white and fluffy like a sheep would be and yeah I love it I'm pretty sure this is from Target pretty inexpensive too so go get you a little sheep y'all in this home goods bag I have a really big thing of body wash um, I don't think I will be running out at any point during the school year. This is so big and it's just vanilla bean scented, which I love. I'm just going to be grabbing things as I go because I'm literally surrounded by dorm supplies right now. So I'll just grab stuff and tell you where it's from. I got this huge thing of napkins. I'm pretty sure this is from Target. Um, I wanted cloth napkins, but I figured that wasn't very practical since I would be like living on the go a lot. So I just got paper napkins. Once I get an actual apartment in New York, which probably won't be until next year or the year after, I'll probably get cloth napkins just because it's better for the environment and they're also so much cuter, so let's be real. It's all about the aesthetics, you guys. This next bag is from Kmart. I usually never go to Kmart, but my mom suggested it. Everything there is so cheap, you guys. I highly recommend if you're going dorm shopping. I got a lot of good, necessary stuff. First thing is a Swiffer Sweeper. This is literally the generic brand one because it was $15 cheaper and your girl loves to save money. And I'm pretty sure it will do just as good of a job at Swiffing. Swifting? Swiffing? Swiffering? I don't know. I also got the dry like pads to go on it as well as the wet ones in here. And I got three razors. Hopefully this will last me for the first semester. I don't really grow a lot of body hair so I don't really need to shave that often and I always get men's razors now because they literally work so much better let me know why that's a thing please <laughs> literally let me know I got this mattress pad from TJ Maxx for $19.99 and it seems really fluffy I also got a topper to go underneath it because I heard that the beds are like kind of hard and I really like a soft bed so yeah tj maxx you guys from target i got this down comforter i'm pretty sure i won't be needing this the first few weeks of school anyways because new york is pretty much hot until september or october so yeah but this seems like a really really big cozy comforter um i got it in a full size because i really like to kind of like hog the sheets a little bit and like bundle myself up at least that's what everyone tells me when we have to share a bed so yeah i always go for an oversized blanket on top because i'm gonna like end up making myself into like a little burrito in the blanket anyways so may as well go bigger and yeah it's just white for sheets i went with a light gray these are from target i just got twin xl um these seem like really nice quality sheets especially like considering they're just from target you know um and these are the vintage washed percal personal I don't, I don't know how to speak english anymore <laughs> sheets from target and they're in the light gray color um yeah i just thought this would be like a good way to go i always have white sheets and i think like a light gray will be a nice change this is actually the first thing that i ever bought for my apartment and this is a shower curtain liner i literally always sleep over at my friend's houses and they never have these and i think it's so weird no offense if you're my friend and you don't have one but i literally like can't shower if there's not like a liner behind the curtain because then the freaking shower curtain just like flies everywhere when you're showering and it's you just feel really exposed and vulnerable so i like to have one of the like plastic shower curtains on the inside just to like keep everything from flying away um, I got this at TJ Maxx, $4.99, copped a good deal. Just some random things, I got band-aids because you never know when you're gonna need one. I get blisters all the time. 90 bobby pins because I'm always going through these and especially now that I have bangs, I always am looking for a way to like tuck them back, whether it's in French braids or just like pinning them back. So. My mom came through with these. I got dish soap because like I said, we have a kitchen and we will be doing dishes quite often, I hope. So yeah, this is just the Myers dish soap. My mom wanted me to get like the nice like organic brand. So we went with Myers because she was like, you're moving to New York. Like, I don't know why that was the reasoning behind it, but I'm moving to New York. So I need organic dish soap. A deodorant because 
if you don't use deodorant, you really should. Keeps you from smelling bad. Also got toothpaste. If you don't use toothpaste, you really should. I recommend this brand. It's Crest 3D White. After I got my braces off, this stuff saved your girl's life. Cetaphil face wash. If you don't wash your face, I highly recommend you should. <laughs> this is really good. It's really gentle and I have really sensitive skin, so this is really good. It doesn't do the best job at removing your makeup though, so just a heads up. Aside from the plates, this might be the, my second favorite thing that I purchased. This is a throw blanket for my bed. Again, I probably won't need this until later into the school year. Um, but it's literally like a salt and peppery color and it's like knit or crocheted, I don't know. Sweater knit blanket, literally that's what it's called from Target. Um, and I got this because it would be like a sweater for my bed and I wanted to like knit one of those giant blankets with my arms but I don't have time for that. And the yarn is like $100 so. I went with this, second best thing and it looks so cozy. And you can get this at Target for, I don't know how much, the price isn't on it but... Go to your local Target and get this because it's really freaking cozy and I'm obsessed. This is actually something that my school sent me. I know that's like insane to think that Parsons sends their students something for free. Really it's not free though because you're spending like literally so much money to go there. This is a swell water bottle that's white and says Parsons. I thought I would include this in the haul because I'm obsessed with this. The school is very like environmentally friendly. They don't really sell plastic water bottles on campus. So they want to make sure that everyone has a water bottle. So they sent everyone, every student, a water bottle that's specific to their school. So some people have ones that say laying on them. Some people have Copa ones. Some people have Menez or M I don't know how to pronounce the name of the school. Some people just have ones that say the new school. But I got a white one that says Parsons. And these water bottles are like $30. So I was really excited to get this in the mail. Next up, we have Brandy Melville. I know what you're thinking, Brandy Melville doesn't sell home decor. Well, guess I, well actually no, they really don't sell home decor. I was talking to my manager one night when we were closing, it was like midnight, she was tired, and I was like, can, can I take some hangers for my door? And she let me take hangers for my dorm. So basically I got free hangers and they're like the really cute Brandy Melville hangers. I'll show you what they look like. This is them. I have like three packs because I'm gonna have a really small closet so I really don't need more than like 30 hangers. I'm going to be living like very minimally while I'm there and when I need, whenever I need new clothes I'll just have to come home and like switch out my wardrobe. Yeah, but these are the hangers. They're just like regular wire hangers but they're wrapped in white fabric which is so cute and I don't know, I just really wanted Brandy Melville hangers and I got some. So yeah, sorry if you like wanted these hangers. I don't think you can buy them at Brandy Melville. Um, but you actually probably can buy them online. I always hear customers being like, oh, I have these hangers. I'm like, where, where do you get them? But I got them at Brandy. I have a whole other like section of my room filled with stuff from my dorm. I'm probably not gonna get through all of it, but I will show you guys a few more things. I got a steamer. I didn't think I would need one of these, but my roommate had one when I was at Oxbow and it really came in handy sometimes. So yeah, I got a steamer. This is from Bed Bath & Beyond. It was $20. And I really do think this will come in handy. I hate having wrinkly clothes, so perfect. Clorox wipes. Sponges. I have like five of these. They're like soft on one side, scrubby on the other we don't have a dishwasher we have to wash all our own dishes by hand i'm literally becoming an adult you guys please be proud of me q-tips if you don't use q-tips i recommend you should don't stick them all the way into your ear because then you'll die i don't really know what will happen but they're good for cleaning out earwax they're good for taking off your makeup they're good for first aid and they're good for home and electronics my mom ordered me this umbrella off of amazon it's like the clear bubble umbrella kind of thing I didn't really ask for this but I've always wanted one and she got it so she's a true queen for that I cannot wait to use this although I hope that it's not rainy all the time that's like literally the main reason why I didn't want to move to London because of the rain this isn't even home decor this is a turtleneck I got a shower caddy from Target I had the same one at Oxbow and I got rid of it and I regret that but I got a new one got a ramen maker for the microwave 
and I got a bunch of things to hang stuff on the walls. I really want to do like a gallery wall, um, similar to the one that's in my room now, but like a little bit more curated and put together. So that will be really handy. Some of the things that I didn't show were my pop-up hamper from Target. This over-the-door shoe hanger, which I really hope will come in handy so I can maximize storage. Um, as well as like everything in here, like the storage bin. Towels and stuff like that. Um, and like silverware. I also got a second set of sheets in dark gray jersey for the winter time when it gets cold out. And more kitchen gear, which you can't even see. Hold on. Just like cooking spoons. <laughs> but yeah, that's like pretty much it. Peace out, y'all. Love you. If there's anything that you think I'm missing, it's probably that my sweet mates bought it because we're like going in on this together. Um, or it's just in my room and I didn't show you because there's literally so much stuff. Um, but yeah, that's, that's basically everything that I bought for my dorm. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you next time. Bye.